Angular is slightly more popular in enterprise level big companies. Why? React is more popular in smaller companies and startups. Why? Are you confused what you should choose, Angular or React? By the end of this video, you will decide the best one specifically for your needs. So let's start. One very important thing is you can choose between Angular or React based upon what is your current background or experience. This is the most important thing. Do you have more experience in JavaScript or you have more experienced in OOPS based technologies like C Sharp or Java? If you are a JavaScript person, then give preference to React because React is nothing but a JavaScript library. Most of the JavaScript concepts will be reused as it is in React and therefore it will be very easy for you to learn them, understand them and implement them. But 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 if you are from C Sharp or Java background and you are not comfortable in JavaScript, then give preference to Angular. Because Angular have TypeScript and TypeScript is more like object oriented programming. Like we have this, uh, we have classes inheritance polymorphism in C Sharp and Java. Similarly, we have these concepts in TypeScript also. Sometimes we also use JavaScript in Angular, but mostly we have to code in TypeScript only. So based upon your background, you can pick the best one for you. Second point is you can choose between Angular or React based upon what are people around you working on. For example, you choose React, okay, but some of your friends or colleagues are working on Angular. Then when you are learning React, but nobody you have to discuss with you, right? Because all are learning Angular. You do not have any community. I know there are physical uh, online communities there, but you know physical communities are much, much better than online communities. Also after finishing the learning, what's the next step? Job in React or Angular. Okay. Who will guide you there? What kind of jobs are there in market? Your friend, your friends or colleagues only, right? So pick the one in which your friends or colleagues are already working in. Third point is you can choose between Angular or React based upon which technology projects are present in your current company. See whatever we learn, we must have a plan to execute it, right? For example, you already did the hard work and finally you learn React. Now what? You need a project to implement it, right? If you will not work on React, then after one year you will forget all the things. So you should have the visibility that okay my company have Angular or React projects even if I am not looking for a job change, I can join these projects. I will gain some experience from there and then I will switch the company for the better pay scale, whatever. Fourth point is you can choose between Angular or React based upon what type of job is your ideal job. For example, enterprise level jobs for job security are better and startups and freelancing type jobs are giving good salary. So let me give you an example here and the fact is purely based on my experience. Mostly enterprise level companies prefer Angular. The reason is they like frameworks. Big companies know that their websites have to perform complex tasks in future. So they choose framework. React is a library and Angular is a framework. But, but, but React is more popular for small businesses, startups and among students also. Uh, because it is lightweight and there are thousands and thousands of small businesses websites which are in React. That is why React websites are more more in number as comparison to Angular. Also for freelancing, React is the first choice. So you decide what is your preference and then start learning. I think until now you have decided, but if you have not decided yet, then let me tell you the last thing. Uh, don't learn anything. This is not sarcasm. Maybe the actual question is in your mind is not clear. For example, you are confused not between just Angular or React, but you have other options also like 
Azure, AWS, DevOps, Machine Learning, Data Science, etc, etc. What to choose now, okay? For that, you can subscribe the channel and I will be helping you in taking the decision for your career. But if you have only options between Angular and React, then please do not procrastinate. Do not waste time in taking decisions. Let me give you the logic here, okay? It normally takes 15 to 30 days to learn Angular or React. If you are giving it on average 1 to 2 hours daily, okay, average hours daily. You will not be an expert then, but you can start working in a project. Now suppose you learned Angular in 30 days, then it will take just 10 days to learn React and same in the opposite case. Both are the best front-end technologies. Finally, you can let me know, like in the comment section, which is the best one for you, Angular or React. Or still, if you have any question, then you can also ask me. And don't forget to like and subscribe the channel if you want to take the right decision in the technology career.